These numbers are not adding up. Well, mathing is hard. <laughs> good morning, Benny. Good morning, Cherry. Oh, good, good morning, morning Councilor Ruthie. Ruthie. Listen, did you girls hear what happened at our rival camp Hudaho last week? Who do tell? Well, they had to lock up all of the cabins for fumigation. Oh my heavens! Whatever did they do? Well, the whole place was intense. <laughs> <laughs> intense. intense. <laughs> Ruthie, you are too much. Now, Ruthie, dear, do you got the skinny on the new crop of campers? I sure do, and I truly believe that America's next camp queen is right here. Well, let's quit yakking and take a look. Here you go. Hi, I'm Alexis P. Bevels. The P is for pumped, because I am so pumped to be here at Camp Wanakiki. Alexis, because my muggle name is not too far off from that. And Bevels is because when I stand like this, that's called a bevel. This is my first time at summer camp. I used to go camping with my dad, but whenever I would wear skirts and stuff, I would get weird looks. Hi there, my name is JJ Snap Turtle. I am from Madison, Wisconsin, the capital of Wisconsin. I am a 36 year old, fabulous clown without a crown, as I like to put it. I'm kind of a hodgepodge crafty, Michael's clearance kind of drag queen. Uh, I've been doing drag for about six years. I like to think that my aesthetic is like Brody meets Grandma meets Cartoon meets Happiness. Hi, my name is Sylvia Nix. I'm 25 years old and I'm from Milwaukee, Wisconsin. And I would just like to say to the folks at home, go pack go. The activities I'm most looking forward to are making jackets out of roadkill, fishing for compliments, and rubbing mud in the other girls' faces. I'm not worried about the competition because mostly I don't really pay attention to my surroundings. Hello, my name is Pagan Holiday. I am 33 years old. I am originally from Portland, Oregon, but now I live in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. In my spare time, I enjoy chronic masturbation, alcoholism, and sobbing uncontrollably alone in my room. My secret move is doing a cartwheel and having my tits fall out. I am looking forward to seeing squirrels, eating porridge and hot dogs, and pooping in an outhouse. I hate nature. Hi, I'm Olaja. Welcome to Wanakai Kai. It's actually, it's Camp Wanakiki. Okay, let me try it again. <laughs> Hi, I'm Malaysia. Welcome to Wana Kiki. Wana Kiki. Kiki. One thing I'm looking forward to is making s'mores out of the girls' wigs. I've never been camping before as a woman. I have been as a man. Oh, hi! Muffy Fish Basket here, reporting to you live from Camp Wana Kiki, Chicago, Illinois, representing. I like to be a good role model for children and a bad role model for their dads. So uh, does anybody know, is that Wrangler guy? Is, does he have any kids? No? All right, all right, never mind. <laughs> hey y'all, it's Say Kevy. I'm the body positive art ho from Chicago. I love showing off my body. If some tiny, thin person can wear next to nothing and call it fashion, well then my 323 pound ass is gonna do that too. I'm really excited to see all the other girls and looking forward to sending them all home. Yay! <laughs> I'm Dominique DeGrant, and I've come here all the way from Eau Claire, Wisconsin. My favorite color is pink, as you can see. Hashtag the pinkening. I do everything myself, from clothes to jewelry. If you have any questions, just get a hold of me, and you can ask me about my lady secrets. I'm not a big fan of competitions, because usually I go home with a really big crown, and it takes up a lot of space, but it should be fun. Looks like we might have our work cut out for us, gals. 
Oh, I don't know, Cherry. There's plenty of raw talent in here. I think we can have these campers shipped into shape quicker than a frog lets a fly off a cow turn. <laughs> Counselor Ruthie, how'd you like frog legs for dinner tonight? Oh. <laughs> With ranch, of course. <laughs> now, come on, girls, we gotta get cracking. We do. Oh. Basket, I swear to fucking God, you make one wrong move and I just might start wetting the bed again. I got ten words for you. Brush your teeth. <laughs> this is the fortress of doom. Oh. Anybody got a carrot? <laughs> Close your legs! <laughs> Campers, report to the camp office in five minutes. Summer camp is about to begin! Good morning campers and welcome to Camp Wanakiki, where summer camp is a drag. My name is Apple Brown Betty. My sister Cherry Pie and I are your camp directors. So if you ask me, Betty's the one that needs direction. <laughs> Cherry Pie, you are such a tart. Over the next week, you will be competing against your fellow campers in a variety of daily camp activities that will put your campy, can-do spirit to the test. Ah uh, yes, but remember campers, here at Camp Wanakiki, you are not always judged by how fast you can run a race. As long as you give it your Camp Wanakiki campy, can-do try, it's not always about who crosses the line first. Indeed. And to help you along the way is our dear cousin, Camp Counselor Ruthie. Hello, campers! Hello, Ruthie! In addition to the daily camp activity, every night there's a camp talent show. Each camper that survives the daily camp activity and the talent show will earn a camp badge. But unfortunately, there are not enough badges for everyone. So at the end of each day, we'll have to send one of you packing. Sad but true. But the last camper standing will win the ultimate crown of Queen of Camp. Mm. Well now, let's get this show started, shall we? To the late! Today, campers, you'll be pursuing your water sports badge. Ooh. Ooh. Nothing like getting your feet wet the first day of camp. Mm -hmm. Now, like all water sports, it's better in pairs. So you'll be partnered up for this challenge. We are going to pick the teams by randomly selecting your names out of this bag. Let's see. Dominique is paired with the JJ. Yeah, we are. Oh, <laughs> hey. Yeah. All right, Alasia. <laughs> Woo! Your partner will be Muffy. Yes. Malaysia. <laughs> oh, the fish basket. Ooh, salty bitch. Girl. All right, next up we have Kevin. <laughs> Woo. Your oh partner God. will be Pagan. Yeah. Heck yeah. <laughs> all right, do we even need to call it out? Just so you know that we have all the names in here. <laughs> Sylvia. The winners. Oh. The gingers. Alexis! Yay! Yay! Now, for your first challenge, is a canoe race! Oh, 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 oh. oh my god! No, it's gonna be fun! It's gonna be fun! I'm excited as fuck. Everything about me floats. Now, campers, 
what you gotta do is you gotta piddle, I mean paddle around Ruthie's dock and back here. On your mark, get set, go! reminds me, did I ever show you that letter from the ranger about the toxic levels in the lake? I'm sure it was nothing. Keep paddling campers, don't fall in, you're doing great. It's fine. Come on campers! You're gonna run into me! <laughs> no! You girls are going the wrong way! I think that we've proved that if we work together, we can all win yes. the race. Yes. We came in third, and actually, I think we were a pretty good team together. Oh, we were, um, you know, we were working together. I was doing the leading, and and Sylvia was there. Overall, I feel the canoe race was pretty good. Anytime I get to sit on something hard and long, I'm happy. I have trouble floating sometimes. I was scared shitless going into this, <laughs> but we came in second. Yeah, we're number two. We're the shit. <laughs> Woo! We're number two. We're number two! <laughs> <laughs> what was your big winning speech that you wanted to give? Oh, uh, I have to pee. What? Have to pee. Like, That's what you bad. wanted. No, oh. no, no. Oh. I have to pee. I'll be Did back. You? Oh. I have to pee so bad. Girl, oh cover. Put it around your waist. You wanna watch me jump in the lane? Wanna watch me get my body all wet? Watch me play with my pool doodle? a little bit. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna push off. Are you ready? No. Mm-mm.
Good evening and welcome to the Camp Bonakiki Talent Show. Woo! Woo! Boy, we had some fun today with the uh, canoe race, didn't we, girls? I haven't seen that many gay guys excited about a boat since Titanic opened on Broadway. <laughs> I'm just glad they all managed to stay afloat. True. Well, continuing with the water sports badge, tonight we've asked our campers to present their best and campiest water-inspired look. I'm wet already. Well, let's dive right in. Bobby Fish Basket is serving up some bath time business. Notice the corseted skirt and the loofahs around her neck. Feeling dirty? She's got enough for everyone. Hi, I'm Alexis P. Bevels. The P stands for pizza. I had some for dinner. I am giving you Lady of the Great Lakes realness. Some people walk down runways. Honey, I walk down water. Please don't pollute my home. If you do, I'll have to whip up a hurricane and blow you away. Blow you away. Oh, Lasia. I'm giving you fish on a platter with bubble bells with cotton candy hair. I'm selling the feminine curves of a woman coming out of a shower with bubbles on her. But JJ Snappin' Turtle. So today's challenge was aquatic. For my look, I wanted to kind of offer up like a old woman living off her husband's money, saying fuck the grandkids inheritance. You know, at the same time, I wanted to give like a body positive image with both the hoopa, the, uh, the nooks and crannies of the thighs, the knee high socks, and just say, hey, all beauty is beauty, no matter what your, uh, your shape, creed, or color. And uh, you could never wear too much jewelry. So, you know what? That was my idea, and that was my thought, and that's what I went with. Pagan Holiday! I have been splashing around in water, and I am dry as the Sahara, so I'm about ready to shoot a motherfucker unless I get some Jack Daniels. All right, Daryl Hannah, you better watch out, because Mama's making a splash. You see this tear on my face? I will cut a bitch. I am dry, I am wet, I am confused, and I need a nap. Fuck. Say, Kevi. Today, I am a magical mermaid goddess. I have an affinity for mermaids, as I see them as a metaphor for my transition. And I love showing off my body and my stretch marks. Sylvia Nix. The year is 1964. Sylvia just got back from a Beach Boys concert with her boyfriend. They just started going steady. Tonight she's feeling bubbly in her seafoam green fantasy. Dominique D. Grant. Tonight I am serving up blow up doll realness. Buoyant and watertight, when you're drowning, I want you to reach for these flotation devices. Wow, great job, campers. What a wonderful show. Very, very nice. It is clear that some of you are really into water sports. Mm -hmm. Now, as you know, there are eight of you, but only seven badges. So why don't you step outside while we decide which of you will get badge and which of you will have to take a hike. The winner of Camp on Akiki will take home a fabulous prize package worth nearly $5,000 including an all-expense-paid cruise provided by All Out Vacation. You'll also receive free burgers for a year, compliments of Hamburger Mary's, where you can eat, drink, and be merry, honey. All this and a great big wad of cash, too. All right, campers, we've made some decisions. And when we call your name, listen up. Olasia, the JJ, Pagan, and Sylvia. Congratulations, you've all earned your water sports badge. You may all leave the stage and get ready for the badging ceremony. Oh. Muffy and Alexis, you guys are in the top two. Congratulations. Which means Dominique and Kevy, you're in the bottom two. So only one of you will be getting your water sports badge. But first, we'll start with the top two. 
So, um, I had written down here for Muffy, rub a dub dub, fabulous. <laughs> I thought your look from head to toe was just so spot on. It's almost couture, shower couture, chic. I mean, the details of the shower rings, the corset on the back. Can you turn around a bit? Oh, that's beautiful, beautiful. Nicely done. I love it, I love it. Looks like something I would wear. Yay. I think I could see Bette Midler walking out on stage with that. Um, very, very campy, very queen of camp. I thought it was terrific. Lovely. Now, Alexis, uh, what I have written down here for you is, it's like ice bitch queen meets Greek goddess meets like woodland middle earth elf. I mean, it's just magical. <laughs> it is. It Thank really you. is. I wrote uh, Neptune's Naughty Mistress. Oh, I like that. <laughs> yes, when you came out, you did those twirls. It was mesmerizing. I think the twirling won me over. It was terrific. I thought you were just absolutely fantastic. Gorgeous, lovely, terrific. But now, Muffy, you were part of the winning canoe race today. Yes. yes. And it just so happens that you are also the winner of this challenge. Oh. You can join the rest of the campers backstage and get ready for the badging ceremony. You both won your water sports badge. Thank you so much. Okay, campers, this is always gonna be really sad because um, we love you both, but unfortunately, someone has to be in the bottom. I actually thought you both were fabulous. Everyone in this entire talent show was amazing. I mean, it really, really was amazing. I mean, I thought your makeup, Dominique, is always so beautifully done. You have your style that you do. You're the, the, the pink lady. And Kevi Mima has this beautiful blue face. It's so creative. The only thing I would say is like, even though it is creative and I love that you are so confident in your body, um, your wardrobe still has to fit and it was kind of um, falling apart a little bit. And I think that mm -hmm. kind of docked a little bit of points. A little bit of... Otherwise, it's, it, they're both really great, great looks. Um, but unfortunately, only one of you can get a badge. So the way it's gonna work is we are going to vote. We've written your name down. All three of us have written down who we think should get the badge. Cherry. This was so, so tough. Oh my God, I can't. Uh, it was just really, really a tough decision. But I think the person that should get the water sports badge is Dominique. And now see, I also had a very, very tough decision, but I said Kevy should get it. Ruthie, <sighs> the pressure's on. Well, I thought, you know, I guess I'm confused. So, because the other day I found this, so we actually have an extra water sports badge. We have eight badges. We have eight badges. Eight badges. <laughs> Everyone gets a water sports badge. <laughs> we both get a water sports badge. Now go back there and get ready for the badging ceremony. feel when you realize that your wig didn't really count because nobody went? Fuck <laughs> 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 my win, right? Fuck <laughs> 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 my win. <laughs> okay, wait, 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 wait. Hold up, everyone. Um, meeting mm -hmm. all of you has been really awesome. This is really cool. I agree. Thank you know what? I'm giving credit to my girl, Elijah, over there. She, she was terrified to get in that canoe, and girl, we rocked it. Seriously, has anyone been to camp before, like when they were little? Nope, I have. Not yeah. me. I had a cardboard box in the backyard. Oh. Mm -hmm. I went to band camp. I want to climb trees. 
I want to eat squirrels. I love how delicate and feminine you girls make me feel. Oh. I'm glad that you feel things for JJ. No, but I am happy to be here because you guys are really nice. I'm happy that the sugar baker twins are giving us this opportunity They're to twins? get to know each other. Is anyone else moist? Girl, am I am so pasty right now. Uh, and I'm talking about just caked. Caked ooh. on me. Stop mm, caking oh, cake me. Does sound and Have set. the Sugar Baker twins asked anyone else to come to their cabin and play Eiffel Tower with them? <laughs> or am I the only one? <laughs> You want to protect yourself, ladies. Remember, when going to the bathroom, you always want to wipe back to front. And then oh. back again. Come on, Sherry. Get in. Oh, oh, uh, oh honey. That was both of you in there. We're never going to get this thing on beach. Ready? I'm going to give you a good yeah. call. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Dominique's toothbrush. I'm a simple woman with simple pleasures and high expectations. <laughs> Anybody here know the Heimlich? <laughs> Can you choke on a marshmallow? Can you Let me find out. Come on. <laughs> Ruthie's nipples are still hard. Fucker. Get your mouth to mouth grab her and just start making